Hello everyone! In this video I would like to show you how you can create a custom scale for the battery so that you can uh, know exactly what is your state of charge or how much kilowatt you have uh, in your battery. Uh, let me show you what do I mean. You can see here on the instrument cluster I have stick custom scale and when I start the car you will see that there is two scales, one is kilowatt hours and one is percentage. And my car currently has 21 kilowatt hours of uh, energy on the battery and it's around 61%. Uh, so this was sent to me uh, by a guy named Joseph Hubacek. I hope I pronounced this name correctly. We thank you very much, Joseph, for your work, and I think uh, it looks amazing or much better than the Volkswagen originally uh, made. So let me show you how you can remove the instrument cluster and stick here this custom scale. To remove the instrument cluster, first let's uh, lower the steering wheel so we have more room here to operate. Then there's a plastic cover, this one, that we need to pull towards us, towards the driver's seat. Uh, it's clipped on four clips inside uh, the car. So you need to grab it and pull it towards you, like this. These are the clips and they're clipped here. And this end goes to the steering wheel on the bottom. Then, I don't know if you can see it, there are two bolts here. Let me show you what I'm... These are the bolts, one here and one on the other side. They are star uh, bolts. We need to remove them. And after that, the instrument cluster will be free to uh, uh, remove from the car. So, let's remove the, the bolts. First boat. And this is the second boat that is holding the instrument cluster. Now it's time to release the instrument cluster. Uh, what we need to do is just pull it towards us, grab it with both hands and just pull it like this and it will be released. On the bottom there is a cable, let me try to show you. This is the cable, the holder of the cable that we need to, here you can see it better. We need to release it in order to free the instrument cluster. To release this, this uh, connector here, there is a yellow lock mechanism that we need to release. Uh, I will use the plastic card tools like this to help me release it. You need to push it down and this is how you release the lock mechanism and then you just need to push this all the way to the other direction and then disconnect the instrument cluster. To release the transparent cover on the instrument cluster, there are plastic clips all over the instrument clusters that uh, we need to release. So I will use a tool like this. And I think this is the last one. I didn't release this one. And that's it. I broke one clip. But that's it, the instrument cluster. Now it's time to stick here the, uh, the dashboard, the new one. So 
So this is the sticker that I will put here into the instrument cluster. It fits pretty well. Uh, I will remove the the black here because on the instrument cluster there are indications that needs to be shown. So this black will cover them and that's not good. Also, I will remove the scale, not the uh, numbers here, but only the scale because this scale here illuminates on the dark and I would like this also to illuminate and uh, glow uh, whenever there is dark. So I will put just the numbers here so that it can show me what is the percentage and what's the kilowatt left on the battery. This, I hope, will be the final result. It will be difficult because there's a needle here that will uh, not help me sticking this together, sticking this exactly to the uh, point that I would like to go. But uh, I will aim for this gold. <laughs> This is the final result. This part doesn't stick very well. Maybe I will cut it later on. But that's it. Now I'll have to uh, return everything back. I'll have to put the glass cover. I'll have to put the uh, cable here and then the bolts and everything back. So that's it. Uh, I will not uh, shoot the uh, returning back um, the cluster to the car. So I think that it doesn't have any sense. You know how to do that. Uh, this is all for this video. I hope you like it. If you like it, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you soon.